I've been doing video game reviews for about a year now. People have started to ask me, more often than not, what games I'm excited for, for the next year. Well, let me tell you. These are games that I'm getting really excited for for 2010. Number 5, Tatsunoko vs. Capcom. Now I've been playing this game as an import, so I've been very excited that it's going to be coming out to the US. Not only that, but they're adding in three new characters that weren't in the original Japanese release. Like Joe the Condor, my favorite character from Gatchaman. I'm really excited to play against friends here in the US and actually have a chance of winning. I mean, I'm not very good at fighters, but with this one, I think I'll even have a chance to beat up on Sean's Tukas. <laughs> yeah, right, dude. Bring it on. I will! I'll bring it old school! Then come on! I will! Bring it! Take it, bitch! Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down, man. Oh, yeah, right. Sorry. Psycho? Number four, Muscle March for WiiWare. Dude, what can I say? <laughs> Check out this video. I want to play the polar bear. Number three, Metroid Other M for the Wii. A new Metroid game that goes back to its roots. Made by Nintendo and Team Ninja, and in multiple game views, oh, this is going to be one hell of a game. I personally have problems playing first person shooters as they kind of make me dizzy. So having first and third person views will be phenomenal. Also, having both second and third person views makes me even more excited. Some people are worried that it might turn out to be too similar to Ninja Gaiden. But I have no worries on whether it does or doesn't. Ninja Gaiden is an excellent series, as is Metroid. I think it'll be a mixture of both series, and that's what I'm excited for. I miss hunting hallways for items and power-ups. But grandiose battles would just make this even more epic. Number 2, Mega Man 10 for the Virtual Console. The more we see about this game, the more excited I get. And as much as I like Mega Man 9, maybe I'll actually be able to finish Mega Man 10. Now personally, I kind of don't want to see any more spoilers and screenshots, as I like the element of surprise. But just knowing that we'll get another thought-out 8-bit Mega Man game for the Virtual Console makes me very happy indeed. And finally, number one, WarioWare DIY for the DS. I want to make my own mini-games. I want to make my own mini-games. I can't wait to make my own mini-games. Will there be a new Wii channel where you can upload your homebrew mini-games to share and collect? Will you be able to transfer games from the Japanese WarioWare to the US WarioWare? We can only hope so. 
People in Japan have been making some beautiful and creative mini games for WarioWare made in Ora for the past year now, and I only hope it becomes as popular here as it is in Japan. So what games did you enjoy this past year? Send me a video or drop me a comment below, and I'll talk about your choices next week.